in today's video, I will go over what the top five perks are in Call of Duty Modern Warfare Zombies. What is going on guys, Tito's here bringing you another YouTube video. In today's video, we will continue the Top 5 Friday series where every Friday we will cover a new Top 5 in Call of Duty Modern Warfare Zombies. We have already covered the Top 5 Guns and Top 5 Field Upgrades, so if you haven't seen those videos, make sure you go ahead and check them out. And today, what we're going to cover is the Top 5 Perks in Call of Duty Modern Warfare Zombies. I also wanted to thank you guys for all the love and support on the videos. I really do appreciate it, and we were able to hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. The winner of my $500 Amazon gift card giveaway was Dallas Hanico, which according to YouTube statistics, has been subscribed to the channel for a couple of months and commented on almost all of my videos, giving him 22 entries into the giveaway. So please email me at the email in my description to receive the gift card. So make sure you guys drop a like, leave a comment, and subscribe to be entered into future giveaways. And with that being said, let's hop right into the video. Coming in at the number 5 spot will be Quick Revive. Quick Revive is extremely useful when you are playing in a team because it does exactly what the name states and can revive your teammates much quicker, which when you are in some of them higher threat zones can be extremely important when you need to quickly pull off a revive. You can see on the screen here the difference between reviving without Quick Revive and then reviving with Quick Revive. The reason this is coming in at number 5 on the list and not higher is primarily because this perk is only real useful when running in a team and it has no real use when you play solo. Unlike in other Zombies games, Quick Revive and Solo used to revive you when you got down, but that mechanic has simply been replaced by Self Revive, making Quick Revive useless when you do play solo. But due to how beneficial this perk is in a team game mode, it has earned itself the number 5 spot on this list. Coming in at number 4 is going to be PHD Flopper. I know a lot of people likely wouldn't have PHD Flopper in their top 5, but hear me out. PHD has multiple benefits. Not only is it a ton of fun running around dolphin diving into big groups of zombies, killing them all like you're seeing me do on screen, you also take absolutely no fall damage whenever you dolphin dive, which is extremely useful. But PHD makes sure you take no explosive or fire damage, which makes this perk amazing. What this means is that whenever the mangler shoots you, you will take no damage, but even more importantly is that after you kill dogs and they blow up leaving fire everywhere, that fire will do no damage to you, and if you guys spend a lot of time in the higher threat zones like I do, you know how hectic it can get and how many dogs and manglers spawn, making PHD almost a crutch to run if you're in the higher tier zones. And then the final benefit that PHD has, make sure that you take no splash damage from your own guns, meaning you can spam the RGL grenade launcher in close quarters and you won't take any damage, and you can also take no splash damage to the ray gun, which makes this perk amazing. So since this perk has many benefits in solo and as a team, it has earned this perk a number 4 spot on this list. Coming in at number 3 will be Speed Cola. Everyone knows what Speed Cola is. This is one of the OG perks that has appeared in every single Zombies game dating back to World at War back in 2008. But in this game, Speed Cola has multiple benefits. Everyone knows that Speed Cola will help you reload your gun quicker, which can be the difference between life and death. If you're ever cornered and run out of ammo, the quicker you can reload, the better chance you have at survival, which makes this perk phenomenal. But outside of that, most people didn't know this, but it also allows you to put on armor plates much, much quicker. So when you're in them higher threat zones, dealing with those really fast sprinting zombies that can be pretty annoying, you can get your plates off much quicker while running away from the zombies, which is extremely helpful. Speed Cola is personally one of my favorite perks, and since it has many benefits inside of solos and as a team, it has earned this perk a number 3 spot on this list. Coming in at number 2 is going to be Stamina. This is a personal favorite perk of mine that I didn't find too useful in other Zombies game modes. So we all know what Stamina Up is, which it allows you to run faster and for longer. As you can see on the screen, I'm running with Stamina Up while my friend is running without Stamina Up, and you can see how much quicker you can move if you're utilizing Stamina Up. And because of how big this map is and how we only have 45 minutes to get fully kitted up before we are forced to exfil, Stamina Up becomes extremely important so that we are moving as quick as we can, optimizing the amount of time we have in the game. 
And as I've stated before, I spend most of my time in the higher threat zone trying to get some of those rarer loot items and stamina up is very much needed to run and avoid some of them faster zombies which earns this perk a number two spot on this list. And coming in at the number one spot is going to be Elemental Pop. I'm just kidding, I already know people are probably typing in the comments telling me how crazy and stupid I am for including Elemental Pop at number one. But really, coming in at number one is going to be Juggernog. Could it really have been anything else? Everyone knows and loves Juggernog as it is likely the most iconic perk in Zombies history because of how useful it is. This perk is so iconic that the Juggernog fridge was even used as a pre-order bonus back for Call of Duty Black Ops 3. But we all know what Juggernog does, it increases the overall health of your operator, tremendously allowing you to take more and more damage before you go down, which is obviously crucial to surviving as long as you can inside of this game. This perk is useful in any and every game mode, no matter what tier you're playing in and no matter if you are playing solo or as a team. Being able to take more damage from zombies will always be the most important perk to use in zombies, and for that reason, Juggernaut has earned itself a number one spot on this list. But that's going to do it for the video, guys. Let me know in the comments below if you agree with my list, and if you disagree, let me know what your list would be. And also, mention any other top fives below in the comments that you'd like to see me cover, and I'll catch you guys all.